Hi, so in this previous program we have seen how we can send messages to queue. In this program we will see how we can receive the messages from the queue. So we already have a uh, app.js for sending messages to queue. So let's create another file called receive messages to queue. I'll put a code for receive message very similar to a send message half of the things would be the same like connection string we are getting same we have put it down send messages then we are creating a service bus client from the connection string then we have a queue name we have a receiver created from service bus client dot create receiver based on the queue name and we have some logs then we will create a, a delay function to just wait for uh, at least a few seconds or milliseconds before it close and wait for the messages. So it's a delay just you're passing the time and that will be in a millisecond. So it, it is just creating a promise to resolve and set the time out that is time. Then we'll create a main method where we a receiver dot, we call as a receiver dot subscribe we define that and it will receive the messages and print the message body this passing and in case of any error then console dot log the error will be shown on the then let's remove that and I will call this uh, delay method over 50,000 I can make it to a 20 seconds so that we can faster close it okay and at the last we'll close and clear the resources and we'll call the main message so what I will do it I'll create another terminal and in which I will call the receive message.js and receiver started I will go back to the terminal one and I'll send messages. Let's go to the terminal 2. Okay. So the three message came because we have sent three messages from the nodes. Node app.js to Q001. And after 20 seconds, it is closed down the receiver. So this is again a simple I will share the code in the resource section. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.